12 on ESPN. Welcome into a lovely day here in Houston, Texas, and a massive rubber game on tap to cap off with Longhorns in this game, number three. Jared Thomas once again at the top. D. Kennedy, the hero last night back in the two. Surrendered five runs at Texas Tech and four runs at TCU. And this is a guy that sits 87. Walks to Hatchie, 0 for 9 this week in the bag. The payoff pitch is hit hard and right at the shifted second baseman. Make it the shortstop, Kobe DeHaste. John ready for 2-2. And the breaky ball is in there for a call. Strike three, the first punch out. Case. Puts this in play on the ground into the shift. DeJesus sets and makes the play. And Texan DeJesus Murray and two Lamero at the top, who has swung a red hot bat this weekend. A one and three against a 5.26 ERA, 39 and a third innings, 45 strikeouts. Texas pitching staff back on Friday. That's on the ground to short. Jalen Flores is right there. Sets his feet and one shortstop retires, looking for his first strikeout of the afternoon. Check swing and Murray could not hold the hands back. He's down on strikes. 1-1 one, one off the end of the bat on a hop. Flores knocks it down. His throw is in time. Opening frame. One two fastball. John climbs the ladder to pick up his second strikeout early. Sets up a full count 3-2 offering that is hit hard into right center field. Nickens going back, runs it down. Base is clear, two gone. Max Ballou pops this one up. This is going to be a tough play in shallow left. Reese, though, gets there. And he's... Cole hits that up the middle. That won't quite get through. Kennedy on the backhand makes the throw. An excellent effort, but Cole... ninth start here today. Runner goes, pitch outside, throw to second, is in time. Cole can't believe it, he wants a quick review. He can come home. Can't find the zone against Ace Reese, four straight out of it. Houston has another base runner. To start over. One, two on the ground through the left side. Arbolita's got a one out knock. A second hit here on three and two. Goes back off speed and gets a huge strikeout. Will Gasparino, the center fielder, hits this pretty well into dead center. Nickens going back on a late break. He's going to play this off the wall. Gasparino stops at second. Out of a bit of a slump he's been mired in. Go for seven this weekend with four punch outs. Three for his last 20 plus now. But he hits this deep down the left field line. This is hooking and it is a fair ball. Looking to see what he could do at the plate this week and coming alive in a big spot. It was an 0-1 pitch from Gasparino that he put off the ball in center field and then Ryan Galvan 0-1-365 and he got all of it and it got out of here in a hurry. This is lifted high in the air towards left center. Nickens going back, still going to the track. He jumps, crashes into the fence and makes 3-2 pitch. Check swing to Kennedy go, he did not. And it's a two out base runner for Texas. Texas's first two out hit today. On the ground, up the middle, into the shifted infield to Jesus. Makes the play, second time today. Payton looking for his fourth straight strikeout. Instead, this is popped up, left side of the infield. And he's playing his second and final season here at Houston. Ropes this into right field, that's a two out hit. Lou can only play it on a hop. Johnson's 1-2 in the dirt. Galvan throw down to second, sails into center field. Bird. Gasparino had trouble with it in the outfield and just gets Lee it back in. For guys that throw so hard, and you see right there, hits him right in the throat, and that's why when he came up throwing, it was off the mark, but then he... At third and two out, the 3-2. Downstairs, ball four. First pitch breaking ball hit high and deep into left field. Brown to the wall. He's out of room. This is gone. How about that for the Cougars extending the inning? Murray with the two out base knock. Ainsley Tulamara with the walk. And then on the very this three run blast. That ball was hit high. Cole was seeing if. Reese takes again. Another four pitch walk surrendered. Another two-out base runner. Just an inning ago, 
And he hits this pretty well into center. Gasparino got a late break. That's over his head and off the wall. Arbolitas will slide into second. Further damage done. 3-2, downstairs, ball four. Aaron Johnson, four and a third innings, 18 strikeouts to 14 walks, and of course he's coming in, inheriting a dangerous. Lopez on the ground to first. Thomas goes to second and gets the force out there. And that brings the Houston third. The 2-2. On the ground to short, Jesus is there, sets his feet, and makes the play across. And that's why they can continue to count on him to continue to compete. But he's down looking here, his second. Houston. And did he get hit by that pitch? Home plate umpire says yes. Runner goes, hit and run was on. That is chopped foul, just foul. Yeah, Texas took game two last night. 0-2 sprayed into right towards the corner. That'll get down. Blue oh. And there's where you see, you know, the offense. The, the Murray ropes this through the right side. That gets down as well. Eston has the bases loaded with nobody out in their half of the line. VRA across six innings, six strikeouts, the two walks, and he's inheriting a dangerous situation. Very similar to what Charlie Hurst. Nowhere to put to Lamero. The 3 2 he is hit hard into left center field. Brown towards the alley, makes the grab. Nakins will score easily from third, and the sacrifice fly. Spot as he gets the sack fly to add to the fire here in the bottom of the fourth. That's into left center field. That's going to find the turf. DeJesus scores easily from third. He's safe as well. And the throw comes all the way home. Allows Cole. Harold Cole has driven in. Now let's see what he can do to finally stop the bleeding. The third arm here in this frame. From his way out in front of Reese. And he puts him away. The wipeout slider gets strike three. Throw down to first. Completes the K. Go to offering, same pitch, same result. Chase Loomis, what a job out of the Texas bullpen. Hoodman of the year. Swings at that offering, lifts it into right. Arbolita can play it in front of the track, and he's got it. And he hammers this the other way into right center field. Nickens not going to get it. It one hops off the wall. Play just hasn't been the same. Oh, two catches the outside corner, and Brown is down looking for the second time today. First two out hit today. Instead, he takes ball four, a five pitch walk, puts two horns on the bases. 6 3 ERA, eight innings under his belt, seven strikeouts and 10 walks. This is a guy that's been out of the hand of Paul Schmitz. 3 2 misses again, and what a plate appearance from D. Kennedy. Texas loads the bases. And Texas here in the fifth, another 1 2 offering. He struck him out. Big fish. And what this means for going forward, this is the last time they'll host him in a three-game series as a conference opponent. So the first and only meeting. Appearance is 3-1 and one with a 6.38 ERA. 18 and 30 innings, as you see. 21 strikes. 1-2 breaking ball chopped off the plate to third. Powell charges his throw low, but a nice pick by Thomas nearby. 2-2, hit pretty well into left center. On the run, Gasparino, he's trying to play it off the wall. He can't because it's over the wall. Just the second home run of the season for Cam Nickens. Turning on that fastball, 107 off the bat. An estimated distance two-run blast by Nickens over the wall. Just squeaking between. Well, them to take game two. As DeJesus slaps that into right, that gets down. Second hit already. Chopped on the ground to short. Going to be tough to turn it. Flores does get one, but there's no play at first. And Loomis gets the strikeout. Big pitch from Easton Loomis to retire to Lamero. Paul Schmitz is just wearing out the leaf. And he gets the call again. Back-to-back -back strikeouts to start the city. Instead, that breaking ball hits the front foot of Ballou. Six, the one-two. Struck him out. Three straight strikeouts for Paul Schmidt. The Cougars of late. Three-one crush, but right at third. Powell on his knees, snares the line drive. 
does take, and he takes ball four. He's on base for the third time today. They all come. Runner goes on 0-1 and stops as this is lifted pretty well into right center field. Gasparino has room, though, just in front of the track. He does, and he pops it up over the top of the Texas dugout. Is that going to stay in play? It does. That's right back up the middle, and it got past him into center field. And how about the day Ryland Galvan is here late? That's hammered into right field. Arbolita coming in, makes the grab. The throw back to first isn't going to double up Galvan. Galvan running at first, the 3-2. Hammered into left center field. That's going to get down into the alley. Third, he'll score all the way from first. It's a two-out RBI double for Kenny Solis. Yeah, came on to get the final two outs last night, and now back in, making his 13th appearance. Change up off the end of the bat. The shortstop to Jesus makes the play on the right side. And Menace on the ground is short. Flores is there. And takes his time to make the throw across. The edge, but a strike. 3-1 misses as well. A five-pitch walk issued to Nickens. Third hit of the day. Off the fist instead, pops this up. The shortstop, Flores got the best look at it. And he's got it to bring the inning to a close. Three and two. And he does him. Flores lifts it in the air. Shallow center. Nickens a long way to run and a collision, but a catch. Two, two on the way. Popped up towards short to Jesus. Makes the call and the grab. Two down. So Lease fires. A pie ball four. A two out base runner for Texas. Gasparino shoots this into right center field. That's going to roll all the way to the wall. Guess he will without a throw. And an RBI Power double alley makes it. And it hits the bottom. And obviously you see that man right there coming around on his horse is Max Ballou. His line there, three for three, a home run, a double, and a single. And a throw down the third base line. Gasparino comes home to score. He caught the Cougs snapping, oh, tried looking, to take Looking and then immediately takes off. And that throw, obviously, Tulamero comes crashing home. The throw's off the mark, and he never breaks. The 3-2 pitch. At the knees, called strike three. The 3-2 is on the ground over the top of Shaw. Kennedy on the run, makes the play. D. Kennedy has. And he hammers this deep into right field. This one's back. This one's gone. Insured. Patient at the plate today has been reached. Three walks. This one right here finding a pitch he could drive on the 1-0 offering. And he absolutely crushed. One, two. Into center field and hit fairly well just off the barrel, though. And Gasparino. Makes the grab. Win number two on Friday night. 2.41 ERA, 18 and two thirds innings, 29. How rare that is for the UT leadoff man. Hammers this one though into right center field. That'll get down. Finally, Jared Thomas. Has the throw is just a little late. And Texas. Thomas at second being paid no mind. Kennedy off the end of the bat left side. Cut off by Arbolita. His throw is not in time and it's in the dirt. There will be no play at the plate. We've got a two-run game. Throw on the run, skip, and of course, this unable to be handled by Murray. That ball getting away, and then as you see, Jared Moore. Powell, a high drive deep into right field. This ball is gone. Peyton Powell. And it's on their fifth time through the lineup. We talk about them not going down without a fight. Jared Thomas with the double. D. Kennedy with the single. The hustle from Thomas to come home. A 3-2, hit high and deep down the left field line. Will this stay fair? You bet it does. Eight. Jalen Flores proving to be the hero here in the top of the ninth after the two-run blast by left Powell. Line. And waiting to see if it was going to stay fair. It certainly had the distance. It does. And just like that, it has been a four. A 3-2 pitch. Misses inside, ball four. Two hole. Hammers this one deep into right field. This one gets out in a hurry. Three home 11 8 Longhorns. Hey, what a turn of events here in the top of the ninth. The long ball has been to their name in this frame. 
Galvan off the cap. That's over the top of Cole into right center field. Gasparino right off the throw to second. Is not in time. No signs of stopping. Another ball finding pay dirt. Another run across. And man, this is... Benzer's 3-2. Swung out and missed. Borb is down on strikes. Run yesterday, but they have exploded here late today. Thomas ropes one into right. Another hit. His second of the inning. Here comes another run of insurance for the Horns. It's a freshman from Laporta, Texas, the new pitcher. You see his numbers making his ninth appearance. He's 2 and oh. So hard to come by. The 3 2. Misses ball four. The 2 1. Hit pretty well into center, but the ballpark will hold this one. Nickens has a beat on it and has the grab. You see his numbers making his team leading 16th appearance, three and two. Pick up the win last. One, two into center. And the new center fielder, Thomas, ranging back, makes the catch for out number Jimenez. And he got him looking. Strike three called, Houston down to their final. Bame trying to put it away. A check swing out front of the mound. Bame bounces, fires. That's out number three. A tech in Houston. Yeah, what a turn of events in the ninth inning for a second straight time. The Horns are the benefactors. They take games two and game. Small here today for Kyle Rogers and our entire crew. I'm Blake Gardner saying so long from Houston. Watching in the final score today.